there's something a lot cheekier and more mischievous about the way Norman has grabbed some extant poems as well, you know. Uh, there's one number on there called Rehearsing the Choir, which uh, I think is absolutely brilliant what Norman's done with it. Let us speak softly of our troubles The meanings in the slow parade of notes The high thought bubbles It's a very slight poem which uh, if I think about it now, was designed to sort of tease the whole business of community choirs. My wife's a member of the Wellington Community Choir, and it's a very happy, happy choir. But it always struck me as a wee bit strange that here are these people in Wellington singing, you know, horse rustling songs from the Caucasus and, you know, <laughs> songs from Southern Africa and, do you know what I mean? Uh, and so I wanted to write something, just a little throwaway text, which teased that practice, but at the same celebrated the joy that comes off the, uh, that kind of massed community singing. Hola, 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 the enemy is on the run. They weep beneath the setting sun. Hola, 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 hola. Some of these poems called out for more voices. There's a tiny fragment in My Sunshine where a choir kicks in just for one line, Here Comes the Rain. And it sounds wonderful, just this, just this moment of, of sunlight when they're singing Here Comes the Rain, of all things. Mm -hmm. uh, but also on a song called uh, Across the Water, I used a choir. And I really love the sound of that, the richness of it. You know, blended voices is beautiful. So I wanted to do more of that. But when we work together, we can often hear these other sounds sort of creeping in, whether it was a choir, choir or he might just say, that word there needs, you know, needs another three voices just to give that word that lift. And so we'll play around with, say, different chords and, yeah, to try and bring things up and give things a bit more life. And that song is definitely a bit of fun, yeah. And it goes through lots of little adventures, you know, within the text as well and the melodies. It feels of a piece now to me, but while it was being written and as we were rehearsing it, it, it it's unusual. But I think you pulled those two moods, you know, assuming I'm right that those two moods were there, without perhaps even knowing you were doing it, you pulled both moods out of the text and set them inside the structure you produced and the way you used the choruses. And, well, you know how brilliant it is. This is called Rehearsing the Choir. I haven't the faintest idea what it's about. <laughs> Your day among us has arrived All souls will be happy We will sing out all illness And then we will say I loved you once a lot But now Starting to annoy me Let us speak softly of our troubles The meanings in the slow parade of no See 